Lil Bob, the man, the myth, the legend. Look, everybody knows Lil Bob, all right? Lil Bob is, uh, he's that guy, all right? He's that guy. I mean, he's just been able to do so much over his existence, which has been, which is forever, actually. He's existed since forever. Um, there's always been a Lil Bob. You know, Lil Bob's just, he's always been there, you know? Um, for the idiots that for somehow, well, the only way you don't know Lil Bob is if you were born yesterday. So if you're watching this and you were born yesterday, I'm going to tell you about Lil Bob. All right, Lil Bob is, you might have seen Lil Bob from the world-renowned celebrity superstar uh, content creator known as Dippy147. Dippy147 has had Lil Bob on his channel for a little bit now. Uh, but he kind of made a disappearance a little, you know, a little later, and you don't see him as much. So if you didn't know, I'm dedicating this video to Lil Bob. Um, Lil Bob is just that guy, you know. He's just he's he's Lil Bob, man. Nobody else, nobody else is like Lil Bob. Lil Bob is just, whew, man, a sight to see. You know, I, I I encourage everybody to, if you ever see Lil Bob, which is very not 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 much, you know, he he you know his. The cost to see Lil Bob was a little expensive, you know. I actually had to pay 100k just to dedicate a video to Lil Bob. Um, yes, I do have contact with Lil Bob. <laughs> yeah, I know, I know. I've got to do it a big now, guys. I've got to do it a big now. But um, Lil Bob is a great guy, great guy, you know. He just he's, he's a little expensive. So I had to dish out a good 100 Gs to dedicate a video to him. Uh, Lil Bob, what's up, by the way? You know me. I hope I hope you still remember who I am. I know I talked to you like two hours ago. You may have forgotten about me, but Lil Bob, I know, I know, I know you don't. I know you still remember your boy. You know, I, I know you still remember your boy. Uh, hopefully, I, I don't know. Look, Lil Bob is just he, hes a busy guy. You know, he's a busy guy. Being being the world-renowned celebrity that he is, he's always on the move. You know, he doesn't have time to stop or else. You know, he, he wouldn't be Lil Bob, and somebody else would try to take his spot. So Lil Bob, Lil Bob is on that grind, you know, he's doing in that, he's putting in that work, he's putting in that time, he's putting in that effort, you know, he's on it, bro. Lil Bob is just, he's just, yeah, what a, what a guy, man, what a guy. He even gave me some pointers, he told me that, uh, he told me something, he told me, gave me a great advice. He said, Doritos are only chips because nobody would accept it. As candy and that hit hard guys that hit hard I felt that crap I'm not 14 but that was deep like my gosh that was uh that was some ooh, class s advice man and, and I, I was just sitting there dude I had to think I just had to ponder a little bit I was just I was I was starstruck I was like huh no wonder why Doritos is like that it's like I, I would have never known it's like it's like when you think about it you wouldn't see Doritos as candy, would you? No, 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 you wouldn't. Dor Doritos as a candy doesn't sound good. It's just, it's, so it had to have been a chip. Um, I do think that Lil Bob secretly owns Doritos. He probably does, and if so, Doritos, I'm gonna I'm I'm need that sponsorship real soon. But, uh, Lil, Lil Bob, just, you know, he, he, what a great guy. He, he does a lot of things, you know. What does he do exactly? Uh, Lil Bob doesn't need to answer questions, you know. He never told me. Never, but Lil Bob never told me. And I asked him what he did, and he was like, you know, he he just stood there. He looked at me. He didn't even say anything. He didn't even react, bro. He just he just stood there. But I was like, my fault, Lil Bob. I shouldn't have asked that and stuff. And uh, uh, I gave him I gave him my special novelty pen that I always keep on me, you know, for whenever I need to jot down notes. I gave him my pen, and I, and I you know I think he really liked. I think he I think he's really. I think he accepted that. I don't think he threw it in the trash. I mean, he put it in his pocket, but you know, I, I, th I think, I think it's, it's just, you know, from, from one, from one great guy to another. I just, I just thought he should have had my novelty pen. So, um, Lil Bob does have a pen of mine that I own, and uh, I, I just wanted to state that right there. Lil Bob does own one of my novelty pens, but um, more about Lil Bob. You know, Lil Bob is a. Uh, uh, he, he, other than being like a celebrity and stuff, he does know how to, uh, he knows how to, he knows how to bake, you know, he knows how to bake really, really good stuff. Uh, he has a picture on his, uh, social media account of him making some fire, uh, tamales. But Lil Bob just knows how to make tamales, but, but I know you're not here to, or here to hear about Lil Bob's cooking skills, as we all know they're far superior than anybody like Julia Child or... Gordon Ramsay, you know, just those, those, those are mere, those are mere, like, 
It's what your it's what it's when your kid makes like a macaroni poster, and you would you hang it on your fridge to make them feel great. You know that that's what that's what that's what though that's what they are to to Lil Bob. You know, Lil Bob also has he also has like three Michelin uh, star rated uh, restaurants. You may not know them, but that's just because you know you probably weren't good enough to go to them. Um, it is you know <laughs> capitalism, but. Uh, Lil Bob does own some Michelin star restaurants. Uh, I'm sure you all very know. I'm sure you all know. But people like Gordon Ramsay, you know, tremble at the sound of Lil Bob whenever he's coming into the kitchen. You know, uh, he, he sure can beat Bobby Flay. You know, uh, 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 Saul calls uh, Lil Bob when he has no one to turn to. You know, so Lil Bob is just Lil Bob is the he's the champ, you know. Uh, he he is the champion, you know. Uh, three three time, thirty time actually, thirty time. I'm sorry, I got that wrong. Thirty time world heavyweight champion, Lil Bob. Lil Bob has done it all. Lil Bob has done everything there is to do in the world and more. So now he just kind of just chilling, you know. Uh, uh, he knows there's no competition, so he doesn't even need to look for it. But uh, uh, he's just he's just that guy, man. What an amazing person. But um, a little more about him, you know, that you probably want to know a bit more of. Like I said, he made an appearance on Dippy 147's channel quite a few times. But uh, he's just, he's just, man, he's a, the dude's a deity, bro. He always knows what to say, when to say it. Um, uh, just an absolute, like, masterclass person, bro. Lil Bob is just the guy, you know. He's just the guy. And I wanted to just make this video in order to dedicate it to Lil Bob and you know just kind of thank him for all the stuff that he's done you know he probably doesn't get too much thanks but Lil Bob doesn't look for things he just likes to see the world in a better place and you know what I feel like we can all just learn from that example and all become better people imagine if we were all more like Lil Bob imagine that imagine that it would it would just be it would be great right right be more like Lil Bob um, I, I, I might stick that as merch so if you're interested you know let me know but uh we should all be more like Lil Bob. We should all strive to become better people and be similar to Lil Bob as Lil Bob is just the perfect embodiment of what a human or what a person should be and what, should, what they should stand for. So Lil Bob, uh, just, I just want you to know that, you know, I, I, Lil Bob is that guy. He's the guy. He's doing it all. Uh, if I were the only person to, if the world only had one Lil Bob supporter, that Lil Bob supporter is me. You know, uh, if the world is against Lil Bob, then I'm against the world as well. You know, then the, the world does not deserve to exist. And, uh, oh. Oh, wait, what? What? Oh, I just got word. Lil Bob is actually here right now, and he's going, he's going to, he's actually going to give you guys a few words. That's actually pretty big of him to do that. You guys should give him a clap. Go ahead, I'll wait. Clap. Yep, yeah, 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 Lil Bob coming in here, Lil Bob coming through, yeah, Lil Bob is going to actually say a few words of his own and then just go ahead and dip, but, uh, yeah, Lil Bob, I'll, I'll let you, I'll let you take the stage here, yeah, I'll let you, yeah, yeah. Yo, what's going on, it's Lil Bob now, as you guys know, I'm a world-class celebrity due to my coolness and my ability to kickflip. Also, shout out to the Goat Dippy 147 you should totally subscribe to his channel, I watch him all the time. I know you guys want me to stick around, but I have some business to attend to. See ya later, alligators. Also, if you scratched my car, I'm going to- Wow, wasn't that amazing? Wasn't that great, man? We, we, we should all- Man, Lil Bob, what a, what a world treasure, man. What a world treasure. He doesn't even have to speak much, and it's just every everything he says, just he's it's just it's just fire, man. I I I'd buy a T-shirt that said Lil Bob, or I'd buy a T-shirt that had Lil Bob on it. Lil Bob is my hero, and he should be everybody else's hero too. Lil Bob is the perfect example of what you should be and what you should strive to be, and we I I do believe that we we all can learn from uh, we all can learn from Lil Bob and what he has to offer to the world.